Wow. I can't believe they cut that off. What? That video, that solo. Oh, it wasn't done? No. Wow. Wow, that's wrong. Boo! Boo! Hello, everybody, and thank you so much for joining us. That's Alexis. That's Bert. And today, I'm bringing you something cool. Okay. Okay, so we've done a lot of different guitarists. Mm -hmm. This is not technically just a guitarist. Okay. But it's one of the coolest guitar parts um, for a song. Okay. And like a solo? Yeah, kind of. And it's 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 just a really cool song, but the, the guitar solo in here is just very well loved. Okay. Um, especially by me. And it's Dire Straits. Do you know them? No. I don't okay. think I've ever heard of them. Um, hmm. uh, they did I Want My MTV. Um, Money for Nothing? No. No? Nope. God. Okay. Well, MTV wasn't <laughs> I know around what MTV when you were. Is. Uh, yeah, but you don't. Have you ever seen a video on MTV? Yeah. Really? Yeah, but okay. I don't think. They don't even have videos, I don't think, no, on MTV anymore. anymore. I mean, right? I don't have cable, so I wouldn't be able to watch it anyways. Okay. But no, like back when I was younger, like in elementary school, there was MTV. Oh, dear God. I have it. MTV. Okay. Uh, well, they had a song that was about MTV. All their songs aren't like that. No, no, just no. They one? were they've been around for a oh, long okay. time before that. They're they're just an amazingly uber talented band. Uh, Mark Knopfler is is just killer, and the whole band is just great. Cool. Uh, so I think you're going to like this. Um, it's called Sultans of Swing. It's actually based on kind of a true story. Um, so <laughs> it kind of is, and okay. um, but he got the title. Of the song and like some of the some of the lines actually out of the song um, from a band that he was seeing at a bar. Okay. He was he did a he did an That's interview. That's kind of cool though. Yeah. So there's a, a great interview. I'll I'll probably put that interview with uh, Brian Johnson of um, of uh, ACDC, and he explained actually where he kind of got where the, the genesis of the song. Okay. So it's kind of neat. So you get to know kind of like the background of yeah, it. That's yeah. That's cool. So it's very cool. Um, yeah, I'm sure you can appreciate that, like especially if you've known them for a long time and you like. And I didn't songs. know that about the song. Really, I just thought it was like a cool song, and I thought it was almost like um, kind of what would be um, autobiographical, okay. right? It, it, kind of about a band, like a bar band. Yeah, that's what the song's about. That you thought maybe could just be about. I, I thought it was about them. Oh, I thought that they were kind of writing an autobiography about them being not. a bar band or something when they first started, but it's not. That's cool. It was about a bar band. It was just not right. them. It was about the one yeah. that Mark Knopfler saw at some English bar. Hmm. So and interesting. They, they were just yeah. It was very weird. Yeah, that is weird. <laughs> so <laughs> anyway, uh, hopefully you guys like this reaction. I love this song to death. Um, it's Dire Straits, Sultans of Swing, and it's different from different kind of band than what we, I usually bring. Okay. Um, and it's just it's it's such talent uh, in the in the playing. So I think you'll like it just talent wise. I so, like different. Well, very cool. Oh, I'm gonna stop it right there. Remember, if you like this reaction, give us a like, subscribe, and click the bell. That way, you get notified every time we upload a brand new video. Do you want the CCs on? No, I They're don't. They're on right now. Okay, I don't need them on. See, that's why I stopped it. I had to take off the closed caption. <laughs> and since I was already there. There you go. Somebody's going to yell at me and go, you stopped it during the song. <laughs> during the solo. <laughs> Just started two seconds ago. Yeah, I had to turn off the closed captions. I had it on for one of the other videos. Okay, here we go. Kind of sounds beachy. Okay. Like I hear it at the like a beach bar. Okay. You get a shiver in the dark. It's raining in the park. But meantime, sound of the river. You stop and you hold everything. A band is blowing Dixie. Double fall time. You feel alright when you hear the music. Inside, but you don't see too many faces Coming in out of the rain They hear the jazz go down Competition in other places oh, But the horns, they blow in that 
sound Way on down south a very cool voice. Yeah. You check out Guitar George. He knows all the chords. <laughs> Mighty Strictly Rhythm, he doesn't want to make it cry or sing. up under the lights to play his thing And Harry doesn't mind if he doesn't make the scene He's got a daytime job He's doing alright He can play the honky tonk like anything Saving Friday night with the Sultans, with the Sultans of Swing. I was about to say something about the bass. Is that him now? Yeah. Wow. I can't believe they cut that off. What? That video, that solo. Oh, it wasn't done? No. Wow. Wow, that's wrong. Boo! Boo! <laughs> and that was their video. That's crazy. Hang on. Mm. Let me take that off of there. That's crazy. That is crazy, though. Wow. Hang on. Let me go back. How do I go back? Oh, got to go here. Yeah, that was on theirs. Wow. They cut off their own video. That was from them. Interesting. No, that, that, so, oh, okay, no. Hang on. We're going to do something. We got to play the end of the solo. Hang on. I'm going to. With one more thing. I, I got to do it. The oh. We are the Sultans. Hang on. I gotta do it because it's like that. That's what that's makes crazy. part of that. Yeah. Sorry, guys. You know. I mean, if you're a fan of, yeah, of Dire Straits, right. you got. That's the whole rub of the song, or a good portion of it, is the, the tail end of that. You're welcome. Yeah. 
Wow. That is a big part that's missed. Right. I feel like that's like not even just like regular playing. No. Like that's like really cool yes. playing. I, I don't know what that's called, but I love that high pitch, like kind of like a screech of the guitar. Yeah. And he did that quite a few times yeah. throughout the video. And it's I love that. It's like I don't know how they took that off the back end of that song yeah. because that's to me is a huge part of that. That's weird. Yeah. Well, anyways, like when he plays that now, yeah. Like I've seen some acoustic versions of him, and mm -hmm. and where he'll do like clinic or like talks and stuff like that, mm -hmm. and he plays that little piece. It's like that's a very iconic phrasing. That's so strange, and that was on their YouTube channel. Yeah, it's on there. So it it's not like my it fault. I had to switch, but huh. I wasn't going to let that one go. Sorry. No, I'm glad you didn't because I like the end. <laughs> <laughs> what um, do you think? I think it sounds like he has like a ball of fire in his throat. Okay. In, a, in like an a good way. Yeah. Like it's so, it's like deep and it's almost like when he s would sing higher, mm -hmm. the voice would be deeper. Okay. Like like if he, <laughs> if he was getting louder, mm -hmm. it would sound okay. like a gotcha, deeper gotcha, gotcha. voice. Um, but the majority of the song, it is a different song. It's like, um, it, to me, it's not really singing. Mm -hmm. It's musically, it's amazing. But right. singing wise, like it's not really singing. It's like telling a story. It's more of a story. Right, right, right. Yes. Yeah. But I feel like he can definitely sing. Mm -hmm. I just feel like in this song, it wasn't really showed how well he can sing. Yes. You know and that's I mean? a, he has a different type of voice. He does. It's, it's a little bit more, but this was in the 70s. Yeah. So it, but he, Mark Knopfler has a voice that's um, a little bit more folk kind it's of. so raspy. Yes. It's so raspy. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Like it's just when he, and he, like in this, he has such a good like aroma to him like he seems like he's just having fun and well, i couldn't help but like grin while watching them just because i can see the fun that they have yeah and like how they interact i feel like i don't really see that i like the interaction wise i feel like you have the guitar or the main guy and they're mm -hmm. like doing their thing but he's like looking over at his like yeah you know to this guy and you mm -hmm. know over here you know he's like interacting with it i don't know yeah i feel like like it's it could have been a live mm -hmm. but that wasn't live that was no. a, that was a actual video yeah which is cool so i can imagine how they are live oh yeah yeah because i feel like it's harder to front in a camera with nobody watching no them. and they're they're just such polished musicians and they're so talented yeah. they've just been doing it for so long and they actually you know they're just good you know what i mean yeah the bass player i love oh i love that too <laughs> that's, that's so like so deep literally i was waiting for him to stop singing to say something and then you beat me to it sorry <laughs> Y'all yell at him, not me. So you like that one? Yeah, I did like that one. I would like to hear him sing a little more. bit more singing. Yeah. Okay, I will get you a Dire Straits song that has a little bit more singing to it. Cool. Cool. Cool beans. All right, guys. Well, that's very cool. I'm very happy about that. Uh, if you like that reaction, give us a like, subscribe, and click the bell. That way, you get notified every time we upload a brand new video. Actually, I would have been crucified had I not put the tail end of that yeah. song in there. Well, I can see that though. Yeah, I people, can see why you would have like been crucified. Me, yeah, yeah. I, if I was in the audience. And I'd somebody be like, what the that? heck? Yeah. Knowing the song like yeah. I do and going, wait a minute, that's the payoff. That's like yeah. the end. It's it's the, For me, there, it, it's like character arcs, mm -hmm. right? There's a resolve that has to come at the end of that. And it's like having a sitcom and you don't get to resolve. It's like, dude. What? <laughs> so, no, you got to have that in there. Well, very cool. Good job. Yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love that song. No, that I is a good them. song. I love them. They're just such a fun band yeah. to me. Mm -hmm. And they're, they're such... Uh, there's such a memory in my right. head. Like, I I actually didn't know this song before I heard um, Money for Nothing, the MTV song. The That's, MTV. I was younger, and it was MTV came on, and, gotcha. and that was such an iconic video, which we'll do that one too. But um, And then I went back and listened to, like, all their stuff, and I'm going, holy crap, they were around for a long time before yeah. I heard them here. And it's like when you start when you're young, I was 
13, 14. Yeah. And it's like, and then you go back and you buy their albums. You go, wow, you know, this treasure trove of stuff. And it's like, wow. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining us. I hopefully you like that one. Uh, that's Alexis. That's Bridge. And we will see you on the next one. Bye. Later.